Hello, so this is the Yashica 35GS, Electro 35GS. So this is the overall condition of the camera. Okay. So this camera has been done a fully CLA. Means that um, it's uh, clean, lubricated, and also adjusted. Uh, so everything. So everything is in good condition. This is where you open the battery cap, and for the battery, it uses one CR one two three this kind and also 2R44 which is the like a coin, coin battery those kind okay so you just to use this camera is actually very easy this is a lock so when you lock it right you cannot press the shutter so when you want to turn it on just push it like this and after that you can just use the camera okay there's film is right here so this is the bug mode and this is the aperture and this is where to focus so right here I'm going to show you the bug mode first so this is the bulb mode, you can see that it's fully open and when you turn the aperture ring, you can see that it changes as well Okay, so this is the auto mode okay. So to use this camera, you just open the back of the camera After that, insert the film right here Like this, and after that, this thing, you put it into one of the slits right here Okay So just plug it inside, and after that, just wind it when you see that it becomes like this already just go ahead and close the cap okay. so first thing first usually what we do is to check the battery lah. you press the button right here you can see that this thing it lags up means that there's battery inside and after that you just shoot until you show number one right here so when it shows number one means that this is going to be the first photo lah. so for the first photo right just um, adjust the focus already after that set your aperture okay if your aperture is right when you half press the shutter button it won't show anything right here lah. okay but let's say if it's too dark i'll cover my hand in front of the light meter to mimic low light situation you can see that when i half press the shutter button it will lights up the slow i'm not sure if you can see it under the light source okay, like this so you can see better okay so this is to mimic low light situation on my hand in front here you can see that it will lights up right here Right now, it means that this is a slow exposure. That means that this is too slow already for the aperture I'm using right now. So let's say if I put it to 1.7, eventually it'll be fine again. Okay. But let's say if it's overexposed, right now I'm facing towards the light. Lah. You can see that the over here it lights up. That means that this is overexposed. And right now I've got to tune down the aperture. Maybe to fall like that, and eventually, when you have pressed, if nothing shows, means that you can just press the shutter. Lah. Okay, and also to focus, you can just go into the viewfinder right here. There's a yellow page in the middle, and after that, you just gotta turn it. Okay, so this is when I'm turning the focusing ring. You gotta turn it and make sure that it's parallel to the, to the camera itself, like this. And after that, means that this is focused. Lah. Right now it is focused lah, but when it's not focused, it's gonna show something like this. Okay, so this is not focused lah. I will zoom in a little bit so you can see better. Okay, let's see. So there's a yellow patch right there, right? So what you're gonna do is to match it like this. So right now it's focused, and if it shows like this, this is not focused. Okay, I believe that is uh, clear enough for you to do the focusing. So basically that's it with the camera And after you're done shooting already right Okay, after you're done shooting already right You just gotta wind it So to rewind it, just press the button right here This thing, you take it out like this So how do you know that if you finish the film right It's, it's gonna show 24 to 6 la, And after that, when you wind, you cannot wind anymore And you feel that there's a resistance And you cannot press the shutter button also Okay And just to rewind la. Okay after you fully rewind already, you feel that it became very loose Just go ahead and push this thing up And take the film out So basically that's it all. Thank you